Hi YouTube, this is Tara and welcome back to my channel. So I usually um, go through my wig like with some water to kind of keep it from doing this weird type thing right here that it's doing. But didn't get a chance to do so. And um, what happens is this is synthetic, but of course it's sold and advertised as human. And when I'm doing my brows, let me bring y'all in. When I'm doing my brows, I'm getting better at them. Um, brows are just something that I am not. Brows don't break. Brows do not break the bank for me. So, um, as you can see, this one is higher up than that one. They're not level. This one is kind of straight up slanted just a little bit. And this one is slanted. Okay. Um, and this is just going to be something quick and something easy. Um, I don't have on any foundation today. Of course, I cleanse my face. And um, I did a, a, a matcha. I did a matcha mask today before I left work home. So I cleansed my face with the cleanser from the same same brand. Anyway, and um, planning makeup by Yolanda. Okay, so I cleansed my face with her acne, anti-acne cleanser. And this is from the mask that I wear every day. Okay? And so, I said, let me use this anti-acne cleanser. So, this is where I had acne right there. And thank God it's behind the hair. And this is where I had acne. But this has been months and months and months and months. And, of course, I've been washing my face. I've been using the vitamin C oil, everything, and it's still there, okay, and I have just a little high pigmentation over in this area too, and, okay, and around my mouth and my chin, of course. Now, I have on the shade Camel NYX Concealer down here. And I have it around my mouth too a little bit. Okay, and then I clean my eyebrows up with Camel and why it's concealer. So I don't know if I'm gonna use foundation today because I had chicken biscuit for breakfast. Um, because um I didn't bring a new one. And I have some new products that came in that I shopped during the Labor Day sale. Um, Beauty Bakery. I bought a um, eyeshadow palette called Do It For The Gram. It was on sale. So I bought that from Beauty Bakery. And I bought three lipsticks. They came in a box that's shaped like cake. It's like a piece of cake, a pop of cake or something. But these lipsticks are so small, so tiny. And I'm like, wait a minute, let me go back and see how much I paid for these. I'll never pay full price for those because they was on sale. Now, when I buy makeup and stuff like that, y'all know it's on sale. Like I got that Tasha Denona uh, Light Work Palette. I got it for $59. Most people are paying like 80 something dollars for that stuff. I think Natasha Denona is giving Pat McGrath um, a run for her money. I don't pay hundreds of dollars for no, no makeup. That's why I was waiting for Pat McGrath to have her holiday palettes. And unfortunately for me, by the time the holiday palettes get to go on sale, they're already sold out. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, well, I guess I won't get that. And then she'll bring it back. And then she'll put it on sale. And so I'll get it then. And so, of course, I can't wait to try on my lashes from Juvia's Place. Um, I really did like that Tarte um, mascara that I had on yesterday. 
that I was just trying on. And I just have my Farsala here. This is what's in my makeup bag. And it's literally a bag. This is the calligraphy pen from Glam Light, which is a um, liner. And you know I have my Julius Place in shade number three. I have my khaki palette from Huda Beauty. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna use that. Or I'm gonna use my Bare Minerals. Um, Gen Nude, like Generation of Nude, Generation Nude, Gen Nude, okay? Um, this is the one, Savannah, is what I had on my eyes yesterday in my final look video. The one right there at the bottom row in the middle, and I love it. It's just the right amount of shine. It's the right color, the right shade. I would like to try it with this um, Lookout, this brown up here that's called Lookout, and then put the Savannah on top. And then this one right here that's called Wonder. It's more of a dark, dark, dark kind of orangey. And you know what? I said I was gonna swatch this for you guys. Um, because I didn't know if I had swatched it or not. So if we don't get to whatever else is in my bag, that's okay. Um, so I think I have swatched it before, I'm not sure. So this is called Morning Dew. Okay, so you know this is this is a very, very, very light tan. This is called Love Is Alive. This is more of a peachy beige. And then this is Lookout. And look out, it's this deep, deep, deep brown. It's very textured. It's very dry. These two are nice and soft. This one is textured. And I can't tell if it's brown or if it's like a plummy color. Because sometimes, I don't know if I'm going colorblind. Okay, this one is called Sunrise. This one is called Savannah. And this one is called Wonder. Let me get a little bit more Sunrise. And this is what Savannah looks like right there. That's Savannah. Let's get a little bit more. I mean, I love it. It's, it's a nice... Uh, what do you call this? Brass? It has a nice amount of shimmer. There's not a lot of glitter in here. There's gold. It's... Almost like brassy, like a brassy color, not even bronze, even. And then that one is called Wonder, and it, this one has like a green, a greenish gold to it. Okay, so this is it right here. These are the colors. So, I'm going to put this on today if I get a chance to do it. I'm uh, really watching my time when it comes to my break. Because I am going over. Okay, and then I have my 40 from KVD. Okay. And I may not even put... Uh, and these are just... I've already showed y'all these. I got these from the dollar store. Simple as that. Um, so, I probably should have put that on. I hate when, when stuff you know, falls. Let me see. Okay, so 
Let me show you what else I have. Crayon case. I like these. They are really wet. And I got the crayon case. And I showed y'all the box of crayon the other day. This is my foundation brush. Look, it's tearing up. I may purchase her other brushes that she just came out with. I may not. Because um, her brushes are just not, to me, the quality. This is the I Am Magic Velvet Matte Foundation in Togo. I've worn it all week. I don't have it on today. Of course, this is that ColourPop pencil in Mamacita. And this is the NYX um, Micro Brow Pencil Crayon in Espresso. This is the Crayon Case Lippy in Purpose. And it's just a liner. And here's that Tarte eyeshadow. And then here's a fluffy brush. Okay. And then here's the um, MAC candy yum yum and of course here's the novena abh i normally use the mirror in here every day and of course here's another brush by mod a and then here's the planet makeup by yolando concealer brush you know y'all i normally use this and here's the glue duo and i got several makeup bags <laughs> And then here's the matcha uh, eye serum by Elemis. And I don't think I put that on today. Y'all tell me if y'all can tell the difference. Do the dark circles up under my eyes look like they're diminishing? I'm real reluctant to put certain things on my lid, especially during the day, if I'm going to... If I'm going to wear makeup because I do not want it to interfere I don't want to interfere with the performance of the other products uh -oh. I'm trying to get this bag set up, y'all, where I can stick this, stick this thing in here. I had it set up. Okay. All right. So let's hurry up. So what we're gonna do is. I've been putting everything. I guess I would have to swatch the Huda too. And it's just that much. And I do it like this. And sometimes I put it on the back of my hand. And I just go like this. On the both. And I even go here. So I call, I know my hands are ashy. I'm African American. I keep my hand washed. And I keep my hand sanitized. I keep my hand washed going in and out of buildings, on and off elevators, because people touch elevators and they don't wash their hands. People go to the bathroom and don't wash their hands. And let's get up here where it's real, it's dark. It's dark there too. And I'm getting as close to my eye, my under eye as possible because it's darker upon the day or two. Okay, so there. Um, you just seen me apply. And I do that, I leave it at work so that I can use it. Uh, but makeup to me is, it's coming out. So I'm just gonna do it like this. Makeup for me is just um, fun, something, a hobby that I like to do. 
I'm going to put a little bit up under my eyes as well. And then I'll go in with this KVD. And I'm going to turn to the side. That way I can look in here. And you all can see too. Because I'm not going to do any makeup. As far as um, foundation is concerned. So that takes some of that darkness away and I guess, oh, my nose is itching. I won't use a brush brush, but let's do this. So let's go ahead and just put some Farsali on to kind of help mattify. But this has like a burgundy to it. I'm gonna have to Google it. I'm gonna have to look it up. And see, now this is not the liquid powder, you guys. This for Sarley is not liquid powder at all. Let me see. Yeah, let's, let's do that. And I, you know, I've already put products on, on my face and basically I'm just rubbing it off <laughs> when I put the liquid see this is more like a primer see it's more like a primer so you're supposed to put that on first you're not supposed to put it on on top of makeup but y'all see what I just did and see this is not going to turn white at all The other, the liquid powder, actually turns white. Okay. And so, maybe I'll take this brush and I'll dip it in Wonder. Okay. That dark. I gotta use the mirror. Because I can't see. Okay. 
hopefully that's giving it time to really dry down. Oh, oh yeah. That's pretty. So wonder right here, this dark. Hey, how you doing? So I was going to do a liner, but you guys, the liner, my eyes start to want water and um, that's the bag that my, if y'all seeing something white, that's the bag that my stuff is in. And you see how the product is coming out? I just put it back down and this stuff stay, this, this color pop got staying power. I am not going to lie.
So I still get that ombre look by just putting the liner on my outer lip and then blotting and it'll start to come inward. Other than I need to put a little water on this hair. Look, let's see, can we do it like on the side? Let's give us like a little side action. I used to wear it like on the side, but it depends on which eyebrow I liked at the time better. Now see, I messed this eyebrow up as you can see, but it don't matter. And see, now I got me a little side action. So I don't have one any foundation. Okay, so this is what we're working with. Mm -hmm. Okay. Come in. And I have nothing but a liner on my lip. And the more I blot, and the more the product would dis distribute. But I want that ombre look, so I'm not gonna block anymore. And of course, I have my Bare Run Minerals shadow on my lid i have wander on my lower lid and i have savannah up under my brow I also have um, Juvia's Place. I live, I prime. What is it? I live, I prep, I prime, eyeshadow primer on my lid. Okay? Bye.